the overall champ for the age group 6 to 7, Justin Thomas. Golf gave me the opportunity to have some choices in college and uh, I tried to take as many visits as I possibly could. I was on the way home from a tournament and happened to be passing near Alabama and Tuscaloosa and wanted to visit but coach was out of town. Uh, I tried to call him and, and got no answer and my dad and I actually hopped the fence of the, uh, of the facility to go check it out and um, then we finally got on the phone with him a little later uh, that week and um, scheduled a visit and I loved it right away. You know, it just everything about it was great. It was a perfect distance from home. It was only six, six and a half hour drive. So if I needed to go home, I, you know, I could, but it wasn't, it was far enough to where I wouldn't go home all the time. Both Coach Sewell and Coach Limbaugh at the time were awesome. You know, two of my favorite coaches uh, that I had met going through recruiting and they were on the same team. Uh, our team was unbelievable. The guys were really, really good and, and playing for SEC national championships was, was something that was very important to me. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a great school academically. Uh, I just felt like I was going to have a lot of opportunities to, to become not only a better person but a better golfer and uh, you know Alabama exceeded all those expectations. The thing that's it's so cool about Alabama is it's so diverse. You know you, you see you see people from all over. I actually had a, a handful of friends from my high school in Louisville, Kentucky you know that, that came here and then you know, I've made friends with some people from, you know, New Jersey and, and Texas. But uh, at the end of the day, when you know it's where you want to go to school, you'll know. The, you know, the football games are obviously unbelievable. We had such a close-knit um, team, like kind of like a brotherhood type thing. We did everything together. We hung out with the girls' golf team a lot. I became friends with some of the guys in the basketball team who I'm, I'm still friends with. Um, the golf aspect was, was pretty obvious. It, we had uh, amazing facilities and I was able to improve in all parts of my game and, and, and practice and play with some great players that we had in the team and we all kind of pushed each other and they pushed me to get better. Probably my best memory was winning the national championship with the guys. Um, I mean, I'll never, ever, ever forget. I remember I dropped my bag, I ran down the fairway and Trey was running down 17 and we just kind of saw each other from about 200 yards away and just basically ran to each other and just jumped in each other's arms and um, it was so cool. Just uh, win a national championship with some of your closest friends. Uh, yeah, it doesn't get any better. I definitely wouldn't consider myself a legend uh, compared to, to a lot of uh, the alumni here uh, and graduates, but um, I, I would like to think that I'm at least on my way a little bit. I mean, I'm not having even come close to scratching the surface on the, the things that I want to achieve in the game of golf and, uh, and the things that I want to do uh, for the community and giving back and stuff like that. You know, I'm only in my fourth year on tour. Hopefully, you know, the fourth of 25 or 30 in a, in a long, successful career. So just need to continue to stay healthy, um, continue to work hard, keep my head down and, um, you know, see, see what I can do. But, uh, you know, hopefully continue to make the, the Alabama Nation proud.